Christmas setting here in Minnesota at Brainerd International Raceway. The Monday Nationals have come to a close after the NHRA Lucas Oil Nationals. Nitro teams and alcohol teams were testing at the facility today. In particular, this video will focus on the alcohol testing, though we'll take a broad look at the day overall. I was not able to be here for the NHRA National event. I was covering the World Fuel Altered Nationals. You can see more of that event in the future on the Monday Morning Racer YouTube channel. But we need to say and we want to say congratulations to the top alcohol competitors that did win the Lucas Oil Nationals. Matt Cummings in Top Alcohol Dragster earns the Wally and Doug Gordon a redemptive win from his 2022 incident here a nasty crash and he picks up the win here in 2023 and it is a gordon with the top news from testing today the daughter of the event champion the daughter of the defending world champion doug gordon maddie gordon earned her top alcohol funny car license today at Brainerd International Raceway. She made passes in the 60s, 50s, and then after earning her license, for good measure, dipped into the 40s. On the property were the Nitro Funny Car Racers, Robert Hyde and Ron Caps, which signed off on Maddie Gordon's Top Alcohol Funny Car License. We were able to catch up with Ron about signing the young lady's license. Yeah, well, you know, I grew up with the Gordon family. Actually, Mike Gordon, the old man, used to drive and uh, growing up in the Central Coast, um, watching Dougie as a little kid come up working on the car and then finally get his license and jump in the car and of course being friends with our kids and uh, you know watching Macy and Maddie grow into being not only good racers with the junior program but shoot I think last year they were servicing the whole car I mean one of the girls was underneath there doing the bottom end and they went on to win the race I think that was Dallas so it's been fun to watch and Christina Cheryl, the whole family. Um, if you don't know that family, go by and say hi if you're a fan. But it uh, was pretty cool to watch Maddie get in Doug's car, who just went, I think, 540-something yesterday to win the race here. And uh, first lap, smooth as could be. Second lap, ran a 60-something. And then went out and went, I think, 53 the last lap. And you wouldn't have known it wasn't Doug Gordon in there, the way she staged and everything. So. She's a beautiful little girl. They're great kids, and uh, she's going to be a heck of a race car driver in the future. We certainly cannot forget dear old dad, the defending world champion in top alcohol funny car competition, Doug Gordon, on this momentous occasion. Well, Doug Gordon is that much closer to being out of a ride, but he certainly has to be a proud dad with his daughter getting a license today. Oh yeah, no, uh, you know, last year Brainerd was a tough, tough race for us, and this year, I mean, just phenomenal. And Madison did a great job today. You know, we came in here, we just wanted to get her a license, so we backed the car down a little bit, but we don't really know how to back it down a lot to get down the track, so we're like, let's back it down a little. First run, I mean, she did great. She let it off at uh, like 800 feet. It ran a 66, it was like, wow. And it was on probably on a high 40, and then, um, you know, then we just went out there, ran a 50 and 53, and it was just a, re a really cool, too. All the different pro drivers and stuff that were ch paying attention to her and noticing her and stuff is a great feeling, but, uh, we're all so proud of her and are looking forward to 2024 with her in the seat. We'll speak with Maddie on the licensing process and her earning her license on my show on the Monday Morning Racer platform between the slicks this Thursday at 8 p.m. Eastern Time. So be sure to tune in live or see it later on the Monday Morning Racer YouTube channel. Overall, testing here at Brainerd International Raceway saw nearly 20 cars 
take to the strip for testing action. Plenty of nitro cars, alcohol cars, even a few door cars. In the nitro ranks, Tony Schumacher was the quickest with a 370 elapsed time. J.R. Todd and the Coletta Motorsports gang, they had a boomer here in testing, and it certainly damaged that Toyota body. Other names that we're here testing today are Mike Salinas, Bob Tasca, Blake Alexander, Leah Pruitt, Matt Hagen, Justin Ashley. Essentially, most of the field that was here competing at the Lucas Oil Nationals stayed over to test. There is also testing upcoming at Indianapolis Raceway Park. Everyone gearing up for the big go, the U.S. Nationals. I'm Lee Kraft, a.k.a. the Monday Morning Racer, bringing you this report from Brainerd International Raceway, brought to you by McKinney Corp.